Hi everyone. This is Sheetal Chaudhary, your accounts master teacher, and I welcome you all once again to Vedantu Commerce. We all are here for a better future. So, guys, let's start this session with something amazing. First of all, wishing you all a very happy Women's Day to every girl out there, to every woman out there. Happy Women's Day. Equal rights are not special rights. So, this is class twelfth accountancy session, and in which we are going to start a new chapter revision: dissolution of a partner. So today we will be covering some important question of this chapter, and this is your today's schedule. After my session, you will be having your economic session with Neha, ma'am, at seven p.m. In which she will be teaching you balance of payment (BOP). So, guys, if you are new to our channel Vedantu Commerce, then please take a moment to subscribe to our channel for more such classes. And also, do like this video and do share this video. For upcoming notes and session, you may subscribe to our. You may join our Telegram group. Vedantu Commerce, in which all the teachers will be sharing their notes in the PDF form. So, if you have not joined our Telegram group yet, join it quickly. So, join it quickly so that you will get all the notes on time. Hi, Manjeet. How are you? And if you guys want to explore your skill of learning with us. Then go and take Vedantu Commerce Pro subscription, in which we will be providing you all these amazing benefits, which includes ten plus teachers having more than five years of experience. You will be getting test and assignments also containing thousands of questions. You will be provided more than two thousand hours of live online teaching. You can watch unlimited live classes. Of all the subject, whether it is accounts, maths, business studies, or economics, and we will also focus on your weakness. We will work on your weakness. So all these benefits are provided at the actual price of three four nine nine. The actual price is three four nine nine, but we are providing you flat twenty percent discount. After which you have to pay only two seven nine nine. So you will be getting twenty percent discount right now. You are good. I am also good, Manjeet. In Mumbai, the lockdown will be happening again, na maybe. Hi, Safi. So guys, what are you waiting for? You will be having your final exam, board exam soon. So go and take your pro subscription right now, so that you can get good marks. And for discount, you may use my code S C Pro. And I would love to see you all on pro subscription. Hi, Mamta. Hi, Prince. Hi, Vikas. How's your exam? So let's start the new chapter revision: the solution of partner. So we are going to see that how to do revision of this chapter. Which se questions important hain, aur hume kaise karni hai revision. So as I have told you that as per the new CBSE update, there will be total eight journal table. So you have to focus on journal entries also. So today we will be focusing more on the journal entry part because there are lot of journal entry in this chapter. So we have to learn the journal entry also. Oh, Vikas, paper tough tha matlab. Ho jaoge Vikas, pass to ho jaoge. You have to score only thirty three out of hundred for that. So let's start with this chapter now, and starting with the question number one. Pass journal entries in the following cases. We have to pass journal entry in the following cases. So first, 
transaction is expenses of realization 1500 realization dissolution expenses given are 1500 now it is not mentioned that kisne ye kharche pay kare hai kuch bhi nahi likha so by default we assume that it is paid by firm if nothing is mentioned that who had paid these expenses you will assume that these are paid by firm so journal entry will be realization account debit to cash or bank account 1500 this will be your journal entry realization account debit to cash or bank 1500 second transaction that we have is expenses of realization 600 kiske kharche hai kitne kharche hai 600 but paid by the mohan apartment there are dissolution expenses 600 if nothing is mentioned who will bear these expenses firm will bear it they have to be borne by firm ye kiske kharche hai firm ke kharche hai lekin ye pay kisne kare partner ne kare hi rachit so expenses of realization were 600 they are to be borne by firm but actually they are paid by partner so now, if these are expenses of firm, agar ye firm ka kharcha hai, you will debit realization. These are to be borne by firm, so realization account debit. And it is paid by partner. Ab dhyan se suniye ga, ki agar mera kharcha, aapne pay kar diya hai, if my expense is paid by you, to aap mujh se paisa wapas loge ya nahi loge. Of course, you will take that. आप मुझसे पैसा वापस मांगोगे? आप ये तो नहीं कि मुफ्त में आपने मेरा खर्चा पे कर दिया कि चलो माम का खर्चा हम पे कर देते हैं. So you will take that amount back from me. So now I have to pay that money to you. अगर आपने मेरा खर्चा पे कर दिया, मेरे पार्टनर ने फर्म का खर्चा पे कर दिया, तो फर्म को वो पैसा पार्टनर को रीइंबर्स करना है. फर्म को वो पैसा क्रेडिटर को देना है. So, partner will now become the creditor of the firm. Because firm is liable to pay that amount to the partner. And therefore, partner capital account will be credited. So, Mohan capital account. So, if the expenses of firm is paid by the partner, the entry will be realization account debit to Mohan capital account 600 rupees. And second one, we must not enter in realization account. He is paying personally. Manta, he is paying, but that is the expense of firm, na? So, firm will record its expense. This is the expense of firm that is paid by partner. If it was the expense of partner, if it was personal expense of partner, then we have to pass no entry. अगर ये फर्म का खर्चा नहीं होता ये पार्टनर का खर्चा होता और पार्टनर ने पे किया होता देन इन दैट केस वी हैव नॉट पास एनी एंट्री बट दिस इज द एक्सपेंस ऑफ फर्म व्हिच इज पेड बाय द पार्टनर एंड फॉर दिस यू हैव टू पास द जर्नल एंट्री ममता ये फर्म का खर्चा इसीलिए यू विल पास द जर्नल एंट्री कमिंग ऑन टू द थर्ड ट्रांजैक्शन Mohan, one of the partner of the firm, he is a partner of the firm, was asked to look into the dissolution of the firm, for which he was allowed a, real, a commission of 2000. We have appointed Mohan, one of the partner, to look into the dissolution process, for which he will be paid commission of 200. So you are giving commission to the partner. It is your expense. It is the kharcha expense of the firm. So realization account debit to partner's capital account to Mohan capital account. This will be the journal entry. Because you are giving commission to the partner, his or her capital will increase. An increase in capital is credited. So realization debit because it is expense. 
two partners capital account because the capital will increase so realization to mohan's capital account 2000 coming to the last transaction of this question motor car of book value 50000 taken over by creditor of the book value 40000 in full settlement your motor car is taken by the creditor at 40000 in full settlement aapka asset is acquired is taken over by the creditor and i hope that you all know that in this we will record no entry when the asset is taken over by the creditor we have to record no entry for that congratulations prince you have answered it absolutely correct so there will be no entry for transaction number four. So this was your first question of the journal entry, which is very important. Because I am pretty sure that there are 90 to 95% chances that journal entry will be asked from this chapter. Manjeet, which si transaction will you explain karni hai? Manjeet, transaction number 1, 2, 3, 4, which si wali? Fourth, Manjeet, your creditor was given to you 40,000 rupees. तो क्रेडिटर ने क्या किया आपका एसेट ले लिया आपको क्रेडिटर को पैसा देना था पैसे की जगह आपने क्या दे दिया उसको अपना कोई एसेट दे दिया आपने उसको कार दे दी कि मेरे पास पैसे नहीं है आप मेरी कार ले जाओ तो जब भी आप अपने किसी क्रेडिटर को कोई अपना एसेट देते हो कार मोटर व्हीकल बिल्डिंग कुछ भी देते हो तो उसकी कोई एंट्री नहीं होती सो यहां पर मेरे क्रेडिटर ने मेरी कार ले ली मैंने अपने क्रेडिटर को कैश की जगह क्या दी कार दी तो इसकी कोई भी एंट्री नहीं हो सो दीज आर योर आंसर्स गाइस नाउ कमिंग ऑन टू क्वेश्चन नंबर 2 सो इन दिस क्वेश्चन आल्सो वी आर रिक्वायर्ड टू पास जर्नल एंट्री इस क्वेश्चन में भी हमें जर्नल एंट्री पास करनी है सो लेट्स रीड द क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम स्टार्टिंग a and b there are two partners sharing profits and losses in the ratio of 5 is to 2 they have decided to dissolve the firm unhone decide kiya ki firm ko band karte hain asset and external liabilities have been transferred to realization account assets and liabilities have been transferred to realization pass the journal entries to affect the following you have to record journal entry in the following cases. First transaction that we can see is bank loan of 12,000 is paid off. Bank loan, your liability is paid off. Tell me what will be the journal entry. Manji, Prince, what will be the journal entry? I have one answer. Congratulations, friends. You have again given a correct answer. Yes, when you pay your liability, the journal entry will be realization debit to either cash or bank account. Because you are paying your liability, it will result in decrease of assets. So you will either credit cash or bank. So realization debit to cash or bank, 12,000. 12,000. Manjeet, you will not debit loan. This is not partner's loan. This is third party outsider liability. So it will be transferred to realization and then you will pay it through realization. Ye partner's loan nahi hai kya? Partner's loan ko debit karoge, bank loan ko debit karoge. You will debit realization. Second transaction A was to bear all the expenses of realization for which he is given a commission of 400 
A will look out at the dissolution expenses for which he is given commission of 400. Well done, Prince. The journal entry will be realization account debit. Because you are giving commission, it is your expense. It is the expense of firm. So at the time of expenses and losses, we have to debit realization. Two partners capital to A's capital account. Because you are giving something to the partner, his capital will increase. Increase in capital is always credited. So realization to partner's capital account, to A's capital account, when we give salary or commission or anything to the partner. Hi, Lokesh. Third transaction. Deferred advertisement expenditure appeared in the book at 28,000. Deferred revenue expenditure, it is undistributed loss. It is accumulated loss. So this expenditure, this loss will be distributed among partner. So you will debit partner's capital account. At the time of loss, we debit partner's capital account. So A's capital account debit. B's capital account debit to deferred revenue, deferred advertisement expenditure. 28,000 will be distributed among A and B in the ratio of 5 is to 2. So it will be 20,000 and 8,000. Well done Sankalp, you have given a correct answer. Thank you so much, Mamta, and same to you. So the journal entry will be A's capital account debit 20,000, B's capital account debit 8,000 to deferred advertisement expenditure 28,000. Third journal entry, fourth, sorry, fourth, stock worth 1,600 was taken over by B, by your partner, at rupees 1200. Hi, Ujwal. Your stock, your asset is taken over by partner at 1200. So, the journal entry will be partner's capital account debit, B's capital account debit to realization account. When your partner take over your asset, the journal entry is partner's capital account debit to realization. So B's capital account debit to realization 1200. This will be the journal entry. Next, fifth we have as unrecorded, sorry, it will be a. Uh, sorry, it will be an unrecorded computer realized 7,000. There was an unrecorded computer, an asset which is now realized 7,000. Thank you, Rakhi. And same to you. Happiest woman day. Bye, Rachit. So an unrecorded computer realized 7,000. The journal entry will be cash or bank account debit to realization you will receive cash or bank Aapko paisa milega, increase in asset debit and you will credit realization because it is your income so cash or bank account debit to realization seven thousand cash or bank debit mamta you uh, you are receiving money it is realized means it is sold an unrecorded computer is sold for seven thousand so cash or bank will be debited and realization will be credited you will not debit computer so cash or bank account debit to realization seven thousand coming to the last transaction there was an outstanding bill for repairs, rupees 2000, which was paid off. There was an outstanding bill, which is to be paid off. It is your liability. You will pay your liability 
and the journal entry for payment of liability will be realization account debit to cash or bank when you will pay your liability this will be the journal entry realization debit to cash or bank 2000 2000 total creditor of the firm were 40000 creditor were 10000 were given a piece of furniture costing 5000 ye bata dijiye ujwal okay so give me one minute ujwal so this is the last journal entry of this question outstanding bill for repairs 2000 was paid off it is your liability so you will pay your liability the journal entry will be realization account debit to cash or bank 2000 so these are your answers you can check it out later so now i am explaining one point which is ujwal's doubt the doubt is total creditors of the firm are 40000 they they were given they were given so i am reading the point i am not writing it, it will be too lengthy Total creditors of the firm are forty thousand. Creditors worth ten thousand were given a piece of furniture, costing eight thousand. So now we have made payment to the creditors worth ten thousand. Total creditors were forty thousand. Out of out of which creditors worth ten thousand have taken the furniture. So now. we have to not make any payment to these creditors the remaining creditors 30000 were paid at discount of 10% the remaining 30000 creditors were paid at a discount of 10% so the journal entry will be ujwal the journal entry will be realization account debit to cash or bank 27000 because 30000 minus 3000 it will be 27000 so you will pass only this journal entry realization to cash or bank 27000 out of 30000 you will subtract 10% discount that will be 3000 so amount aa jayegi 27000 well done prince aapko sari journal entries aati hai So this was our second question. I hope that this is clear to everyone. So now we come to our next question, question number three. And here we have our next question. Question is Kumar Sham and Ratan. Kumar Sham and Ratan were partners in a firm, sharing profits in the ratio of five is to three is to two, respectively. The ratio is five three two. They decided to dissolve the firm with effect from first April two thousand thirteen. On that date, on the date of dissolution, the balance sheet was as follows. This is the balance sheet on the date of dissolution. Thank you so much, friends. So, ये balance sheet आपको given है on the date of dissolution, and this is the some additional information. the dissolution resulted in the following this we will read later now read the requirement prepare realization account capital account and bank account we have to prepare three account hame realization account banana hai partner capital account banana hai aur bank account banana hai so first step in the realization account is to transfer all the assets sabse pehle apan log kya karenge realization mein hum log sare assets ko transfer karenge 
so plant we will transfer furniture we will transfer motor van stock and debtors we will transfer these five assets and not cash aap log cash ko transfer nahi karoge you will transfer five assets on the debit side of realization plant furniture motor van stock and debtors so transfer these assets on the debit side this is your realization account on the debit side two sundry asset plant 80000 furniture 45000 motor van 25000 stock 30000 and debtors 71000 total assets that are transferred is 251000 total assets jo humne transfer kare hain unki value aa gayi 251000 now after transfer of liability assets after transfer of asset you will transfer liability and there is only one liability there is only one liability creditor so you will transfer creditors also on the credit side by sundry liability creditors 120000 creditors ko bhi transfer kar diya now after transfer of assets and after transfer of liability you will read the additional information ab hum log padhenge additional information so first a first additional point that is given is plant of 40000 was taken over by kumar at an agreed value of 45000 aapka asset is taken over is taken over by partner your asset is taken over by partner at a value of 45000 so you will record this on the credit side of realization by kumar's capital account 45000 by kumar's capital account 45000 so this is the asset taken over by partner and in the same point it is written that and remaining plant realized 50000 जो बचा कुचा प्लांट है जो बचा हुआ था इट वॉज सोल्ड फॉर फिफ्टी थाउजेंड सो इट इज सोल्ड सो यू विल राइट बाय बैंक स्टॉक फिफ्टी थाउजेंड यू विल राइट इट एज बाय बैंक सो बाय कैश और बाय बैंक प्लांट फिफ्टी थाउजेंड लेट मी शो यू द वैल्यू बाय कैश plant is taken over is sold for 50000 this is a remaining plant realized 50000 so you will write it by cash plant 50000 now coming on to the next point the next point is furniture realized 40000 furniture realized 40000 means furniture is sold for 40000 so again you will write down by cash 40000 hum kya likhenge by cash because it is sold it is not taken over by partner so by cash furniture 40000 so where it is by cash i have written the plant and under this by cash under this i will also write down furniture furniture is sold for 40000 by cash ke niche hi main likh dungi furniture is sold for 40000 next point is next point is motor van was taken over by sham for 30000 your asset your motor van is taken over by the partner aapke partner ne aapka asset le liya hai so you will again record this on the credit side of realization by shams capital account by shams capital account 30000 
so record it on the credit side by sham capital account 30000 partner ne asset liya by sham capital account by partner capital account 30000 rupees Sachin Nen, please don't spam the chat box. I hope that this will be clear to you now. Coming to the next point. This is important. Debtors realized 1,000 less. Debtors are sold for 1,000 less. So what is the book value of debtor? The book value of debtor is 71,000 and they are sold for 1,000 less. So, subtract 1,000. So, 71,000 minus 1,000, how much you will receive? 70,000. So, buy cash debtors 70,000. So, debtors, how much will be received? 70,000. How much amount will be received? 70,000. 71,000 minus 1,000, 70,000. Ab chalte hai agle point ki taraf. Last second point. Creditors for 20,000 were untraceable. Aapko pata hi nahi hai, jo 20,000 ke creditors the, wo kaha par hai. So how you will make the payment if they are not, un if they are untraceable? So now you will not make payment to these 20,000 creditors. Because wo trace nahi ho rahe, hume pata hi nahi hai kaha par hai. So hum paise kaise denge? So creditors of 20,000 were untraceable and remaining creditors were paid in full. Jo baaki ke creditors hai, aapne unko full payment kari hai. So let's check out the book value of the creditor. Total creditor are 1,20,000. Total creditor are 1,20,000. So you will subtract 20,000 which are untraceable. And now you will pay 1 lakh to the creditor. Now you will pay 1 lakh to the creditor. So 2 cash payment made to the creditor is 1 lakh. कितने पैसा देंगे हम लोग क्रेडिटर्स को वन लाख एंड नाउ कमिंग ऑन टू द लास्ट पॉइंट ऑफ दिस क्वेश्चन रियलाइजेशन एक्सपेंसेस अमाउंटेड टू फाइव थाउजेंड रियलाइजेशन एक्सपेंसेस अमाउंटेड टू फाइव थाउजेंड सो यू विल पे दिस रियलाइजेशन एक्सपेंसेस टू कैश एक्सपेंसेस फाइव थाउजेंड to cash expenses 5000 now we have recorded each and every transaction in the realization account ab humne sari transactions ko record kar liya hai so it's time to close this account and find out the profit or loss so ab hum is account ko close karenge do the total of credit side do the total of debit side so, the total cash received from asset is 160 plus 30,000 plus 45,000 plus 120,000. Do the total of credit side. 120 plus 45 plus 30,000 plus 160,000. Total of credit side is 3,55,000. Total credit ka jo aya hai, wo hai 3,55,000. Total of debit is 2,51,000 plus 1,00,000 plus 5,000, 3,56,000. So credit side is more than the debit side. So, there is loss of 1,000. There is loss of 1,000 which will be distributed among partners Kumar, Sham and Ratan in their ratio 5 is to 3 is to 2. So, jo bhi profit ya loss aega, wo aap partners mein old ratio mein baatoge. So, by loss transfer to Kumar, Sham and Ratan, 500, 
300 and 200. This is your realization account. Now tell me, is this clear to everyone? Is this clear to everyone, realization account? Ujwal, Prince. Yes, Ujwal. Okay. So now we will prepare partner's capital account. Now we will prepare capital account of the partner. Tarun, trial balance mein doubt hai, toh aap mujhe kal 4 baje pooch sakte hai, because this is class 12th session. You may ask your doubts in class 11th at 4 p.m. tomorrow. So in the capital account of the partner, we will first record opening balances. First of all, you will record these opening balances. On the credit side as buy balance brought down. Then after recording the opening balances, you will record the asset taken over. On the debit side, you will record this. Motor vehicle, motor van taken over by Sham and plant taken over by Kumar. When the partner take over asset, we record it on the debit side of capital account because they have taken over the asset. And then you will record the loss of realization. So in the capital account, we will record balance brought down. First of all, by balance BD, 68,000, 50,000 and 27,000. Then on the debit side, assets taken over by the partner. Kumar has taken over plant. Sham has taken over furniture. So, two realization debit side of the capital account. And then you will record the loss of realization on the debit side. Because partner's capital are debited when you distribute loss. So, two realization loss, 500, 300 and 200. That's it. Nothing else will be recorded in this capital account. So, it's time to find out closing balances. 68,000 minus 45,500, 22,500. 50,000 minus 30,500, 19,700. 27,000 minus 200. 26,800 and these closing balances you will make the final payment to them to cash. These balances will be paid to them because the firm is dis dissolved. The firm is dissolved. So to cash the final payment will be made to the partners. And at last we will prepare bank account. Sabse last mein hum log kya record karein? Banayenge, we will prepare bank account. And what you will record in bank account? In bank account, first of all, you will record the cash balance. We will prepare cash account, not bank account, because the cash balance is given. Agar cash ka balance given hai, to aap cash account banaoge. Agar bank balance given hai, to aap bank account banaoge. So, in this question, cash balance is given 14,000. So, we will prepare cash account. Hi, Yash. So, on the debit side of cash account, you will record the opening balance. Two balance brought down 14,000. Then, on the debit side, you will record the amount received from realization of assets. On the debit side, you will record the amount received from realization of asset, 1,60,000. Jo paisa aapko asset beke mila hai, usko aap debit side record karoge. To realization, 1,60,000. On the credit side of realization account, you will record 
the payment made to the creditor the payment made for the realization expenses credit side hum log kya record karenge jo humne creditors ko payment kari hai and jo humne realization expenses pay kare so this will be recorded on the credit side and you will also record the payment made to the partners so this is your cash account first we will record the opening balance 14000 then second you will record the amount received from realization of asset to realization assets ko bek ke jo paisa mila 160000 on credit side you will record all the payment jo bhi aapne payment kari hai wo aap credit side record karoge by realization payment to the creditor 1 lakh by realization payment of expenses 5000 by kumar capital sham capital and ratan capital you will record the payment of capital 19700 and 26800 after recording all the receipt and all the payment you will do the total and total should be equal टोटल जो है वो आपका इक्वल आना चाहिए इफ इट इज नॉट इक्वल देन आपका आंसर गलत है सो दिस कैश अकाउंट एक्ट एज अ बैलेंस शीट एज वी हैव प्रिपेयर इन दी प्रीवियस चैप्टर एंड इट एक्ट एज अ प्रूफ वेरिफिकेशन ऑफ योर आंसर इफ इट डज नॉट मैच देर इज सम मिस्टेक इन योर आंसर सो दिस इज योर आंसर दिस इज योर कैश अकाउंट नाउ दिस क्वेश्चन इज कंप्लीट So tell me, is this clear to everyone? क्या ये क्वेश्चन सबको समझ में आया Yes or no? Come on, guys, tell me quickly: is this question clear to you or not? Okay, so these are the working notes that we have prepared for you. You can check it out later. So, guys, if you want more classes like this, if you want to solve more such practical question with us. then you can take vedantu commerce pro subscription in which we are providing you all these amazing benefits which will surely help you for your boards exam the actual price of this pro subscription is 3499 for one month but right now we are providing this at 2799 at flat 20% off so go and get your pro subscription right now at flat 20% discount by using my code sc pro and you can score good marks with the help of this pro subscription and for upcoming notes and session you may subscribe our channel and you may join our vedantu commerce telegram group agar aapko notes pdf form mein chahiye then go and join this telegram group asap so that you can receive all the notes in pdf form and you can also subscribe our channel vedantu commerce if you want to watch more such classes so do subscribe our channel vedantu commerce and do like this video and share this and this is your math schedule you will be having your maths classes on alternate day monday wednesday and friday at 11 am so now see you all in the next session next class with the same chapter more advanced question till then thank you everyone for watching this session i hope that you guys enjoyed this so don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and now see you all tomorrow at 6 pm with some advanced level question of this chapter till then good night have sweet dreams and take care bye everyone